But first tonight at five new conversations around short term rentals. It's a topic that began nearly a year ago after a deadly Airbnb shooting claimed the life of one woman in Overland Park. Just in the last couple of weeks, Kansas City introduced two ordinances in response to audits on home renting programs like Airbnb or VRBO. These new ordinances are just the start as conversations grow in our neighborhoods. KSHB 41 reporter Abby Dodge has been following the response to the growing rental industry. She shows us how communities are coming together to create solutions. Neighborhoods throughout Kansas City have a shared concern. It's Tiffany Moore's job to gather them all. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. She's a member of the Kansas City Neighborhood Advisory Council. It is where we live. It's where we choose to live. It's where our neighbors live. And this is a very different dynamic when the individuals that are occupying a home in a residential uh, environment, when they're not really your neighbors. We've been talking to residents throughout Kansas City for months. Some of their biggest concerns about short-term rentals have been nuisance parties and not knowing their neighbors living next door, but there could be some more long term effects that Kansas City just hasn't felt yet. Each of these short term rental addresses no longer having any permanent residents in Kansas City. That means no one is attending school. No one is voting. No one is responding to the census and those kinds of population losses at scale have a really long term impact on how the city is funded. While the council works to finalize their ideas to pass along to the city, city council has gotten a start on ordinances of their own hoping to get them ready for a citywide vote in April. Why is there such a need for speed in all of this? We have heard from some neighborhoods that entire blocks or most of a block is already converted um, to this business activity. So, you know, we need to we need to move quickly because the industry is continuing to grow in all cities, including ours in Kansas City. Abby Dodge KSHB 41 News. The ordinances Abby mentioned will be in front of the special committee for legal review this Tuesday. You can read the full language of those ordinances on our website, KSHP.com.